Good morning guys, welcome to Sunday. This week's weekend vlog is just gonna be one day because we didn't vlog yesterday. Um, I don't really know why, I just like wasn't really feeling it. We've had a fairly busy week because Mike's been back working full time um, and it's just been a bit of an adjustment for us. Um, so he's still been home, he's not gonna be in work until next week. Um, but it's just been like, bit of an adjustment with Riv and just like working out a bit of a new routine and we just kind of wanted a day just with just chill and not vlog um so we didn't vlog yesterday but today I'm up pretty early it's about seven o'clock was well, about ten to seven been up since about five because a certain little somebody wanted to wake up early and she never normally does this she normally wakes up at about half past six seven um and she didn't go to bed until half nine last night either the later she goes to bed the earlier she wakes up how does that work um, so yeah, she is playing upstairs with Mike who is horizontal and trying to, he, like, you know when you have like matchsticks in your eyes, like trying to stay awake and she's going, Daddy, Daddy, wake up, it's morning, it's morning, wake up! Um, so they're upstairs and I've come downstairs to make some breakfast. I'm also going to put away all of these veggies. Um, we had an odd box delivery, um, when was it? Yesterday. <laughs> Obviously yesterday, it hasn't been sire all week. Um, yesterday and I just washed everything so it's been drying overnight. Got some goodies. Um, but yeah, I'm going to make another smoothie bowl for breakfast and then get ready to get on the Peloton again. I've got a, another pyramid like session like I did last week. I'm gonna do that again today because I loved it. And that's it for the updates. Let's make some breakfast. Happy days. I'm gonna go and see what mischief River is getting up to. <laughs> Are you climbing a mountain? She calls our bed head the mountain. Are you climbing the mountain? Oi, bunny rabbit bottom. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> I did it guys. Um, what is it, an hour and 20? I was not feeling it today, let me tell you, but I did it. I did not do fantastically well in it, but I finished it. And I can now hear, put my towel in the wash. I can now hear Mike and River causing mischief somewhere. I'm gonna go find them. Found the gang watching Zootropolis with a baby. Where are we going? Change the nappy. Oh, change the nappy. He doesn't have a nappy on. He's in the nakey nakey new. Need to find a nap. Nakey nakey new. In case you haven't realized as well, this is the ugliest and scariest looking doll ever. She loves it. It is horrendous. Show me your baby, Riv. Oh, such a nice baby. He's got a sore body, Mummy. He's got a sore body, has he? We've solved the problem. <laughs> the baby's got his nappy on. Put him on the sofa with Piggy. Or with Squidge. I think the perfect fit. The nappy is, is just right. Oh, <laughs> dear. There's a really big poo. <laughs> There's not a poo in there. Where? It's a naked, naked poo. Oh, now he's naked and he's on a stinky poo. And you want to find that one? He needs sun cream, apparently. So we're about to chop up River's first pineapple. She's had pineapple before when she was little, but not since she's been old enough to like get involved. And she's very excited. Mama. Yeah. Totally chop it up. We're gonna chop it up. It's very spiky, isn't it? Have you um, felt it? Mummy, tell me you always got to. Okay, I'll chop it. I'll chop it. First piece of pineapple. This is gonna be interesting. You're gonna try it. Hmm. Nice. <laughs> Tasty. Hmm. Is it good? 
Seems like a seal of approval to me. Turns out the pineapple is a hit. She just told me, it's delicious. Everybody loves pineapple. Hey? So I'm now gonna chop the rest of it up and I don't know if we're gonna get through it all because that's quite a lot of pineapple, but she's going for it. So today's baking mission, I'm making some lemon muffins requested by Mike because Mike doesn't like blueberry. So last time I made blueberry muffins and he wasn't very impressed. There's the dry ingredients. Gonna put the wet stuff in. Let's see how they turn out. Only got two lemons, so I'm using two lemons and a lime. Um, hopefully they're gonna be tasty. I also wanted to do it with River, but she had zero interest in joining me, so I'm doing it on my own. My two year old's too cool for me. I have gained a sous chef. <laughs> She's brilliant, good job. So they're quite full. Hoping they're gonna be all right. In they go. And I've also just made a little lemon drizzle topping on Mike's request to go on the top. Should be delicious. If you're gonna make lemon muffins, you've gotta have lemon drizzle. Gotta have the drizzle. What are you making for lunch? I'm just gonna do some uh, Chef? baby pasta. Oh, baby pasta. Veggie pasta. Oh, I thought you said baby, baby pasta. pasta. I was like, what about for me? <laughs> what are you putting in? Courgette, spring onion. Courgette, spring onion, onion, onion. I'm gonna have some spinach. Spinach. And uh, I think we're probably a bit low on tofu. It's a aubergine? On tofu. No. <laughs> My cake's aubergine. Just got told, come on, let's keep moving, mummy. To be fair, Riv, even I'm jealous of your outfit today. The wind's picking up, is it? Come on then, are we going to the trampoline? Yes, okay. Just in case I wasn't tired enough already, this is what I'm made to do, is go bouncy bouncy with all the babies. Hi. And if I stop, Hi. <laughs> she does me to go higher. Higher, higher, higher. <laughs> Check this out for a lunch spread, except for the fact that you are sitting oh. in my chair, my except little friend. Someone's used all the salt. Ah, oh, this looks yum. And the pepper. There's none. Yummy, yummy. <laughs> We've also got some lemon drizzle muffins that are ready. Would you like one? No. In this one? No, you want the biggest one, do you? <laughs> So River is down for her afternoon nap. I actually feel so lucky. I don't know if I've mentioned this before in a vlog, I must have done, but River sleeps from about 2 p.m. in the afternoon. She has an afternoon nap till five. Um, and I just feel like that. I, I don't know if it's that long time. Anyone else with a two and a half year old? I feel like it is a long time. I feel like she naps, she has a really good nap. Um, and I swear, like I'm so thankful for that because without that over the past few months I think I would have gone whoosh, slightly mad because <laughs> it's like my time off and in the week it's my time to do work and just get everything sorted and it's made everything a lot easier than like if she didn't nap it would be hard anyway so I had a really nice long shower I put a mask in my hair still looking a bit frazzled um <laughs> But the, for me, for like rough drying my hair, this is like not frizzy because my hair is normally quite frizzy. Um, put a mask on and just like gave myself a really, really good moisturize. And I'm in sweats and I'm now on the sofa with a blanket because it's actually quite cold today. It was supposed to be really warm and it's not disappointing. Um, with my little piglet, Squidge is here too. She's just there, treacles outside. Mike's gone for a cycle with our friend Jack who lives um, just in the village that we live in and they've gone for, I think they've gone for like 40 miles or something, they're crazy. Um, but yeah, very excited to be back cycling together. Together but apart, you know. Um, cycling is actually good for that because I guess by its very nature you're socially distanced. But um, yeah, so Mike's off for a cycle and I'm just sitting here watching the Michelle Obama documentary on Netflix, which I've wanted to watch for a couple of weeks. I think it came out like two weeks ago. Um, and I finally got around to watching it and I'm just sitting here watching that. And after that, I might I might have a little nap. Um, yeah, self-care Sundays. I'm very much enjoying it. Having a little baby picnic slash beer drinking sesh over here by the swing. 
Riv's playing with the babies, Mike's drinking a beer, well earned beer, how far did you go today? Uh, 43 miles. Crazy man! This is what happens when you can't hang out with your real mates, you just do swinging with the babies and they won't get cold. Back them up. And Daddy's one, two, very three, good at playing with babies isn't he? It's his favourite. <laughs> okay, ready? Ready? One, You're ready to push? Two. Swing! Okay, oh up? no. So I have just made a little bit of dinner, your non-traditional Sunday dinner of um, chickpea and broccoli curry. This is a Mindful Chef recipe. I'm not too into curry but Mike loves it so he's really excited about this but I do love black rice and it's with black rice so that is ready and then Riv Riv who is over here is watching trolls yet again and we are eating um, fish fingers and chips and broccoli and carrots and cauliflower and for anyone asking why she eats differently to us a lot of the time she does because we cook quite spicy stuff like curry she wouldn't eat um, and things like when we do fajitas, I tend to do her like a lighter version, like less spicy. So I'll do like um, a few of the ingredients as I'm cooking it, I'll take out. Sometimes if we eat things like spaghetti bolognese, she'll have the same thing. But obviously like little ones don't always like spicy food. She has like zero tolerance for spice either. She's like too spicy. Um, so yeah, she's got fish fingers and chips and Mike is on the phone. So we just have to wait for him. Get off the phone. So instead of having bath time, the bathroom is now turning into the baby crash. Oh no! Is she crying? Don't, don't crying. Put her dummy in and she'll stop crying. Oh dear. Stop crying. Oh dear. Stop crying, mommy. I swear to God, this is the creepiest baby. Following us round, you know, Sunday night, Max and relaxing in my bed with my mates, my books, my teddies, the dogs, Riv Riv, complete takeover. Babies! Babies! How many babies have we got? All the babies! Who's your favourite baby, Riv? Yellow. The yellow one? The pink one. My goodness me. And this one is just waiting until River's asleep and then she will be about two centimeters away from my face. Piggy and her social distancing policies are questionable, man. Very questionable. So surprise, surprise. As per most uh, Sunday nights, I didn't finish my vlog. That's so it's sweet. Monday, my fell asleep. I feel like we had the most boring day yesterday. <laughs> it's the first, it was so, it was a lovely day, but it was like the first week or weekend even that we just haven't really done anything. Every other weekend we've had like a project to do or like we've been, you know, we want to sort this out or do that. And this weekend I just feel like we were both a bit knackered and just wanted to chill out. So that's what we did and I fell asleep. It's now Monday morning. I've just been on the peloton. Um, actually ended up taking a class in German. <laughs> I don't quite know how that happened, but it was good. I enjoyed it. And once I was on there, I was like, might as well just stick with it, keep going. And uh, yeah, it was fun. Mike, <laughs> my German. It's a good job we speak a few words of German. Um, Mike is dressed up. Woo Somebody's ready to go to work. It's like going back to school. <laughs> it's basically like I packed up my stuff last night, you know, got everything ready, got my coffee. So I don't have to make coffee throughout the day. I've literally made him like a little packed lunch and like made you all the coffees to like top up your coffee. Got my hand sanitizer, you know. Got everything, so. Face masks, got everything ready, you know. First day back at work, crazy. It feels a bit weird actually. I feel like it's, I, like I'm a bit nervous for you. I'm just I feel like we've been locked up for so long. What's it like Peace. in the outside world? Um, so yeah, Mike's going back to work today, being very careful. And I'm with Riv for the whole day, so it's going to be fun. It might be a challenge. So far today she's in a really good mood, so I'm hoping. She's in her toy room, let's go and find her. She's wearing, the sun's out today as well, which is bonus. Um, she's wearing her little embroidered dress I got her last week for the first time, because it hasn't been warm this week, so she hasn't got the chance to wear it. Where is she? Mummy. Yeah, hi. <laughs> Toilet. She's like 
been very quiet in here for a few minutes. How you doing? Okay. Anyway, that's going to be it for this vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. Sending lots of love to you all from us. Just looking what's in there. <laughs> um, and yeah, the bath for the baby. Should we take it in the kitchen and put some water in it? And we give the babies a bath. We'll have to take their pajamas off. Mm. Let's get some water. Go on then. <laughs> okay, I'm coming. Get the ball for the baby. Come on then. There we go. This is going to be our life for the foreseeable future. It's now Daddy's back at work. It's a channel for the baby. The best. Right. I'll see you guys next weekend. Well, probably before then. Not in the. Not in the bathroom. In the kitchen. Okay, okay, we can get that water, okay. I got told. Right, see you soon guys, bye!